Hello everyone, you are welcome to how to solve this very nice algebra equation. x to the power 5 plus 1 over x to the power 5 is equal to 123. Our job is to find all possible values of x to the power 7 plus 1 over x to the power 7. So, let's start. Since this 123 is greater than 0, and here we have an odd power of x. So, x, x must be greater than 0. Now, we suppose that uh, let t is equal to x plus 1 over x and t must be greater than 0. If we take a cube of uh, both sides of this equation, this will become t cubed is equal to x cubed plus uh, 1 over x cubed plus 3 times x times 1 over x times x plus 1 over x. Now, this x will be cancelled out with this x and this equation will become t cubed is equal to x cubed plus 1 over x cubed plus 3 in place of this uh, x plus 1 over x, uh, we replace this value t. So, this will become 3 times t. We move this uh, 3t to the left hand side, then this equation will become t cubed minus 3 times t is equal to x cubed plus 1 over x cubed. Now, if we square both sides of this equation, then this will become t squared is equal to x squared plus 1 over x squared plus 2 times x times 1 over x. And this x will be cancelled out with this x. We move this 2 to the left hand side, then this will become t squared minus 2 is equal to x squared plus 1 over x squared. Let us call this equation equation 1 and this equation equation 2. Now, we multiply equation 1 by 2. So, this will become t cubed minus 3 times t times t squared minus 2 is equal to x cubed plus 1 over x cubed times x squared plus 1 over x squared. Now, this is t cubed times this t squared will become t to the power 5 and t cubed times negative 2, negative 2 t cubed. Negative 3 times t times this t squared will become negative 3 t cubed. Negative 3 t times negative 2 plus 6 times t is equal to this uh, x cubed times x squared will become x to the power 5 and x cubed times uh, 1 over x squared will become plus x cubed over x squared plus uh, 1 over x cubed times x squared will become x squared over x cubed plus uh, 1 over x cubed times uh, 1 over x squared will become 1 over x to the power 5. Next, t to the power 5, this negative 2 cubed minus 3 t cubed will become negative 5 t cubed plus 6 times t is equal to x to the power 5 plus this 1 over x to the power 5 plus this x cubed over x squared will become x plus this uh, x squared over uh, x cubed will become 1 over x. Now, in this equation we replace this uh, x plus 1 over x and this x to the power 5 plus uh, 1 over x to the power 5. x plus 1 over x is equal to t and x to the power 5 plus uh, 1 over x to the power 5 is equal to 123. So, this equation will become 
t to the power 5 minus 5 times t cubed plus 6 times t is equal to 123 plus t and we subtract t from both sides so this get cancelled and this will become t to the power 5 minus 5t cubed plus 5 times t move this 123 to the left hand side this will become negative 123 is equal to 0. Now we notice that t is equal to 3 is a solution it means t minus 3 is a factor. So we can rewrite this equation as t to the power 5 minus 3t to the power 4 plus 3t to the power 4 and we write this in negative 5t cubed as negative 9t cubed plus 4t cubed. Now we add and subtract 12t squared we add 12t squared and we write this 5 times t as a negative 36 times t plus 41 times t and this negative 123 will remain same negative 123 is equal to 0. Now from these two terms we can factor out t to the power 4 and in back left t minus 3. From these two terms we can factor out 3t cubed plus 3t cubed as common in back left t minus 3 and from these two terms 4t cubed minus 12t squared we can factor out plus 4t squared in back left t minus 3 and from these two terms we can factor out plus 12 times t in back left t minus 3 and from these two terms we can factor out plus 41 in back left t minus 3 is equal to 0. Now this expression t minus 3 is common so we factor out this t minus 3 and in back left t to the power 4 plus 3t cubed plus 4t squared plus 12 times t plus 41 is equal to 0. From here either this expression t minus 3 is equal to 0 or this expression t to the power 4 plus 3t cubed plus 4t squared plus 12 times t plus 41 is equal to 0. From this equation we get the value of t is equal to 3 and for this equation since t is less than 0. So we reject this solution and we accept only this value of t 3. Now recall that we have supposed We have supposed that uh, x plus 1 over x is equal to t. We have supposed that uh, x plus uh, 1 over x is equal to t. So this will become x plus uh, 1 over x is equal to 3. Now we recall equation 1 and 2. Equation 1 is uh, t cubed minus 3t is equal to x cubed plus 1 over x cubed and equation 2 is uh, t squared minus 2 is equal to x squared plus 1 over x squared. Equation 1 is uh, x cubed plus uh, 1 over x cubed is equal to t cubed minus 3 times t this is equation 1 and equation 2 is uh, x squared plus uh, 1 over x squared is equal to t squared minus 2. 
this is equation 2 now we replace uh, this t this t with this 3 so this will become 3 cubed minus 3 times 3 this will become 27 minus 9 is equal to 18 so x cubed plus uh, 1 over x cubed is equal to 18 from this equation we will replace this t with this 3 this will become 3 squared minus 2 and this is equal to 9 minus 2 and this will become 7. So, x squared plus 1 over x squared is equal to 7. Let us call this equation equation 3 and this equation equation 4. The given equation is x to the power 5 plus 1 over x to the power 5 is equal to 123. Let us call this equation equation 5. Now, we multiply equation 5 by equation 3. So, this will become x to the power 5 plus 1 over x to the power 5 times x squared plus 1 over x squared is equal to 123 times 7. Now, this x to the power 5 times x squared will become x to the power 7 plus x to the power 5 times 1 over x squared will become x to the power 5 over x squared. 1 over x to the power 5 times x squared will become x squared over x to the power 5 and 1 over x to the power 5 times 1 over x squared will become 1 over x to the power 7 is equal to 123 times 7 will become 861. Now, we combine these two terms uh, x to the power 7 and uh, 1 over x to the power 7. So, this will become x to the power 7 plus uh, 1 over x to the power 7 plus uh, this will become x cubed plus uh, this will become 1 over x cubed is equal to 861. Now, we replace this uh, x cubed plus 1 over x cubed with this value 18. So, this will become x to the power 7 plus 1 over x to the power 7 plus 18 is equal to 861. And we subtract 18 from both sides. So, this get cancelled and we get the value of x to the power 7 plus 1 over x to the power 7 is equal to 861 minus 18 will become 843. This is the required value of x to the power 7 plus 1 over x to the power 7.